Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So uh, today we're just going to talk about um, between the legacy and Mojang accounts. So I made a video a long time ago and let's see if I could pull it up here. Uh, so it's this video here. Uh, this is long time ago. This is like 2017. That's like, I don't know, probably three years. So, um, I've been kind of just silently kind of updating. So a lot of people kind of did read about it. Just, I guess, 14 people. Um, yeah. But, uh, anyway. So what's going on is Microsoft, or Mojang, however you want to call it, they're just deciding that it's time to update their security. I really don't think that's really an improvement, exactly. I mean, if you really like two-factor authentication, that's nice, but I still don't like my information being to Microsoft or whatever. Well, anyway, I'm kind of lost because I'm just doing this out of the simplicity, just trying to make it kind of clear. Um, so I updated my description and everything. You could read my pen tweet if you haven't read already. But, so, this migration form just doesn't work anymore. Because, uh, if you do decide to somehow try my video from, like, three years ago, this will happen. It'll say, legacy account migration is currently on hold. Uh, if you have a legacy account, you, you could read it. Basically, it just doesn't let you do whatever you want. You can't migrate and you know if you ask me questions I probably can't really help you migrate at all but um, so the the update that I did in the YouTube comments here or yeah I didn't really update the description I did say I was gonna put this video here so that will be up in a few few hours I guess uh, so my solution, I mean, this is, this is for me at least, because I'm just going to show you what would happen. Alrighty, so, um, taking a look at this here, um, we have just really one option here. Download for Windows. Need a different flavor. Download for Mac OS. Mobile. These are not free. Uh, Linux. So let me show you what happens when you download this here. Okay, let me let me show you what happens. So if I open this here. Um, Okay, I'll just go ahead and I'll stall it. Okay, so I'm gonna start the client here. Alrighty, so Let's go ahead and two games, one launcher, dismiss. Okay, so somehow it still remembers me. I haven't, I, the thing is I haven't, I don't even use this client. That, that's, that's the thing I'm showing you today. But, um, th there we go. So these are your options here for your Minecraft launcher. This is, this is from here, you know, minecraft.net slash downloads, you know, the general stuff. 
So you get the Microsoft login here. So, you know, people say it works for them. Some people say it doesn't. Um, if, if this is your first time and you just create your account, you're already, you know, you're either in or you're not. Basically, you're, you're already creating a Microsoft account. You're kind of forced to anyway. Now for the people who are using legacy accounts or Mojang accounts, Mojang accounts, you could log in. You could log in perfectly fine. Um, I'll, I'll log in. So as you can see, it, it does work for Mojang. You know, you could still use that, but um, I'm just going to first log out. <laughs> okay, so first thing, log out. Second thing, um, yeah, I, I don't need this anymore. Alrighty, so let me go ahead and show you what's what I'll show you for people who are using Legacy and Mojang accounts. This has nothing to do with Microsoft accounts because this is a totally different client. So right here, this is what I'm giving you guys here. So this is the Minecraft wiki, and this is the official legacy client and I will show you it it's much different if you haven't seen what the official legacy client looks like you're you're gonna be a little bit surprised at first so this website here um, is the thing I'm giving to you guys so basically I don't think a lot of people have seen this client before because um, this is like a client from a long time ago that's made available on the official website but this actually has been updated recently so if I go down here 1.693 that's that's the newest at least all of these um, they don't really, yeah, I would use the regular version, I wouldn't use the beta unless you really want to, I don't know if it works, I know this works at least, I'll link it down in the description, but let, let's download the client, so let's save it, so let's run the launcher here. Looks like you use a new launcher than this one. If you go out to this one. Okay, I'm sure reset my settings. Okay, cool. So, as you could see, um, it looks different. It, it only asks this for your email address or your username. So what I'm gonna do, log in really quick. Alrighty, so now that we're in, you could see immediately that it's much different. Um, so you you don't get a lot of you know stuff in your way. You know you could change your versions. You could play around with these settings here, but the thing is, I am sure that legacy accounts and Mojang accounts should work perfectly fine on this client. And this is the official client, don't get me wrong. Um, it's just not made public. So that being said, I think that's it for this video. Um, if you have any questions, you could leave it down in the comments. But I thought I'd just make a quick video. Just um, introducing this client that I've been using for probably longer than I used it for a long time. I just don't think a lot of people know about this client and I thought I might share it. So, 
That being said, I'll see you guys in the next video.